Value-based care is important because it um, strives to have patient-centered care, um, health of the population, and um, uh, reduce costs. And those are uh, associated with ethical values. Um, patient-centered care is respect for choice. Um, population health is beneficence, doing good, not harming, um, and cost is um, associated with the ethical value of justice. And so I think ethics committees and consult services that are associated with ethics committees have evolved in the following way. We are not just reactive to specific um, dilemmas at the bedside. Ethics committees are becoming more involved um, in developing and maintaining the ethical climate or culture of an institution. Um, ethics committees are involved in um, writing and reviewing policies, and they're also involved in education. What I mean by ethical climate or culture is every institution has a vision and missions and values that are um, promptly displayed on the walls of the institutions. What I mean by ethical climate is that the ethical values um, are um, brought up on every level of discussion in an institution, from bedside to boardroom, if you will. And those discussions and decisions are what make the mission and values on a piece of paper come alive in the care that we provide every day to patients.